back to my channel. If you're new here, hello and welcome. Hi, my name is Jessie. Um, so we're going to get started and I'm going to jump right in so that way we're not taking too long to do this tutorial. So today I am working on creating this wing turquoise look. Um, so before we get started, make sure to give this video a huge thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. So we're going to go in. And I'm going to line my wing using my 35 Sweet Oasis Morph palette. And we're going to go in with this, um, this uh, Island Hop first, which is going to be my base color. So we're going to do that all over my eyelid. And then I'm going to go in with this Hidden Cove color to line my eye. Alright, so next we're going to take a smaller brush, which I am using this brush, which I find really, really easy to outline with eyeshadow with. It's absolutely amazing to do this kind of job with. I did not go that far. Let <laughs> me just spread it out a little bit more so that way it's not running into my eyebrow. Okay, 
So now that we pretty much got that outlined, we're gonna go in and I'm gonna take my fluffy brush, which I'm gonna use this one right here. And I'm going in with my Glam Light palette, the Paint Palette Pro, which is a smaller one. And I'm using the color turquoise. Okay, and it's okay if we have to go back over some of that dark turquoise color. Um, I kind of figured we were going to have to, which is fine. Okay, and then I'm going to take a, um, I thought I had a smaller fluffy brush out here. I guess not. Okay, so I'm going to take my blending brush and I'm going to kind of blend in this crease down here. Or not crease, but this angle. I'm going to kind of blend it out just a little bit and then I'm just going to do the same with up here. All right, so then next I'm going to add my glitter, which I am just using my Sugar High Highlighter from Glam Light, which is like this loose highlighter, which is like really cute and sparkly. So I'm just gonna take some of this and I'm just gonna put it on top of that turquoise color that we put on to kind of give it that sparkle. Okay, so now that we finished that part and gave that a spark, we are going to go in and I'm going to add my rhinestones right here in the corner of my eye. Okay, so now that we have that done, I'm going to go in with my liner and then my mascara.
Okay, and then we're going to go in with my mascara. Okay, gotta make sure I coat my eyelashes because they're blonde, so I don't want them to be a combination of blonde and black. All right, let me fix this corner because I kind of want it to line up with my eyeliner so that way it doesn't look so stupid. All right, so now next I'm gonna put my lash on. Where's my glue? I literally have a hair stuck to my hand. Okay, so I'm taking my IMV eyelash glue and I'm putting some of it on my eyelash. And then we're just going to wait for it to dry, or get tacky, I should say, not dry. So. <laughs> and then we're just going to stick it on. Okay, my loves. I had to go figure out what that noise was. It scared the crap out of me. It was just my son watching TV. All right. So I'm going to let that dry a little bit longer before we add our um, eyeliner. So we're going to go in and I'm going to do my foundation, which I am using the Maybelline Matte Foundation in the shade 1110. And then my fluffy blending brush, or <laughs> beauty blender. And I pretty much got my foundation done. So I'm just going to blend underneath this eye and then up around my cheeks and then my jawline because I already have my neck and my upper forehead done. So the only place I really need to put foundation is around this area okay all right so now we're gonna go in with our concealer and our bronzer and I'm going to conceal underneath my eyes. I really want to go back to my liquid bronzer because this powder bronzer, it's good, but it's not as good as my liquid bronzer. So. Try to find my brush. I'm gonna do right here in the corner of my eye. I'm gonna take my beauty blender first and we're going to do my concealer. Okay, and then I'm going to take my 
brush and I'm just going to blend this in by doing circular motions because I don't want to blend too hard. So now that we have that blended in, my hair, I'm going to have to put some hairspray up here. <laughs> and this, I've always got this little tiny piece that wants to like stick up and it drives me crazy. Okay, so now that we have that done, I'm going to take my translucent powder and I'm going to dab this underneath my eyes. Okay, so then we're going to take, let me see, what else do we need? Oh yeah, we're going to take some of that lighter and darker color that we use, and I'm going to put some underneath my eyes. Okay. So then next we're going to put our eyeliner on. And then my mascara. Alright, so then next we're going to go in with my blush, which I am using my Lottie London blush. Maybe I put it back in here. Did I? Oh, that's right here. My Lottie London blush, which I absolutely love this blush. Can you tell? I'm almost out. So this girl's going to have to get some more. All right, then next we're gonna go in with my highlighter, which I am using the same glitter highlighter that I put on my eyes. my lid down here all right so now that we got our highlighter on we are going to go in I'm trying to debate if I want to put rhinestones right here or if I should just leave it like it is hmm like really trying to debate that I really like rhinestones <laughs> all right so I think I'm going to try it. Try to make sure they're even. Okay. 
All right, so now that, yeah, that looks good. I like that. Yep. <laughs> All right, so now that we're done with that part, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to do my lids. Oh no, please tell me my daughter did not get a hold of my lip line. Okay, good. I really need to get me some better lip liners. I really do. I need to do a lot of stuff when it comes to this stuff. I need to get a lot of more products. Oh. I need to get some different colored lipsticks and lip glosses and stuff a girl needs. So now that I have my lips done, we're going to go in with my setting spray. Alright, shoot, I forgot I got to finish my liner. Okay, so now that I finished my liner, that completes our look for today. And I hope you guys really enjoyed watching this tutorial. If so, please give me a huge thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. All right, bye guys. See you next time.